Hello, my name is George Richmond Scott. I'm the director of both Barrels Theatre and of Small Change, the play by Peter Gill, which will be coming to the Omnibus Theatre when it's able to reopen, hopefully in the near future. I was drawn to this play because of its beautiful, richly evocative, poetic language and the way Gill uses words to evoke a very, very vivid sense of time and place, particularly the 1940s and 50s and Cardiff in Wales, which is where he is from and where the play is set. The central character of Small Change really is engaging with his remembered past, uh, the place he's from, the, the family that he grew up with and his best friend who he loved, uh, in order to try and understand himself and to try and move his life forward from where it's got to, which is a place at the end of his youth where he feels, I think, very stuck and very trapped and, and at a loss um, as to know what, what should happen next, where he should go next. And perhaps that's something that we can relate to the play to our, our, our current time and our current predicament. I've been talking to the designer, Liam Bunster, a lot about uh, memories and, and how we pull this information together and, and frame it in order to try and make sense of it and, and contain it and control it and uh, manipulate it. And we've talked a lot about frames and how the space might frame the performers who are within it and how they might actually have a frame within the space that they, that they play around with and, and move around and, and try to control. Uh, and that kind of hints at and suggests different environments and locations uh, as the, the narrative progresses, although not in a very chronological order. So I'm not going to say anything more about the specifics of that because I don't want to give it all away, but the idea of a space that both um, frames and holds the, the, the players secure, but also makes them look and feel at some, sometimes very trapped is a space that I'm interested in. So I hope that you will come to watch when we are on at the Omnibus and I hope you'll enjoy the two monologues which are also going onto the website along with this talking head.